Good morning. Despite the plethora of opinions brought in the Gemara regarding the proper order of the recitation of Havdalah, the conclusion is clear that Halacha is like Beis Hillel, that we begin with the bracha of Bore Priyagafen, followed by Besomim, then Ner, and concluding with the primary Birchas HaMitzvah of Hamavdil ben Kodesh Lechol of Havdalah itself. Matters get complicated when Motze Shabbos falls out as a Yom Tev, where there's also Kiddush and Shehech Yanu, and that is the Gemara in Pesachim, the well-known Gemara known as the Gemara that discusses Yach Nahaz, which is the conclusion, perhaps we can go into at a later time. However, on a regular Saturday night, as mentioned, it is Hagafen, Besamim, Ner, and Havdalah. The Ramah quotes a later practice to, that it is appropriate time as we begin our new week to recite Psuke, Psukim of Bracha, Psukim which show how Hashem bestows upon B'nai Yisrael the the plentiful bracha upon us. And so it has become the practice to do so prior to, to reciting the actual brachos themselves. There are separate Ashkenazi and Sephardic texts for these suke bracha, but both have adopted this practice and both agree that if one were to leave out these psukim at the beginning of Havdalah, that it would in no way impact upon the fulfillment of the obligation to recite Havdalah. One additional note is to what we are holding. What are we doing with our hands at that time? The Mordechai, which is quoted by Shulchan Aruch, rules that it is proper, since we are recite, reciting the whole Havdalah over a cup of wine, that we hold the, bra- the cup of wine in our right hand to give it a sense of chashivus, to give it significance. And we do that until we conclude the bracha of Borei Priyagafen. And our left hand should be the Habesamim. And when it comes time to recite the bracha of Besamim, we switch hands and we move the cup of wine from our right hand to our left hand and the Besamim to our, back to our right hand. We make the bracha on the Besamim. And after we smell that, we put it back down. Then we can, with the bracha, with the cup of wine in our left hand still, recite the bracha of Borei Meorea Eish and look at our fingers as is the custom. And then for the conclusion, of the bracha of Havdalah, we switched the cup of wine back into our right hand and say the bracha of Hamavdil. So again, the order is, uh, is Hagafen, Besamim, Havdalah, uh, Hagafen, Besamim, Ner, and Havdalah. And then we should always go with the principle that whatever we are making the bracha on should be held in our right hand. And if there is nothing specific that we are currently making the bracha on, then we should switch back and be holding the cup of wine in our right hand to give it the greatest sense of chashivus for this significant mitzvah. Have a great day.